All right, hello everybody. It is I, Granorite, and here we are back with another episode of Let's Play Pokemon Yellow with our Gen 1 type challenge of Electric Type, the conclusion of this episode. So if anybody wants to use any of their channel point incentives, this is the episode that you want to do it um, because we are finishing up. We do have eight playthroughs left, so the types are limited, but we do have six types that we still need to finish out of those eight playthroughs, which means there's a lot of them where we only have one playthrough left in that type. There's one type that we still haven't even done a single playthrough on yet. But we are going to get through Victory Road here and go take on the Elite Four. You know what I'm actually going to do? Got to reuse strength here. We're going to go get Sky Attack for Zapdos, just in case. It's one of the TMs that we usually skip, but there's no reason for Zapdos to still know Thunder Shock when it knows Thunder. Oh, but wait, with the level up, nah, that was, well, we're gonna learn agility with Zapdos. That might be better. Yeah, it already knows Drill Pack. Never mind. It was a thought, but it's passed. Got him. Do nothing. And there's no trainers in Victory Road that we really have to worry about, like type wise. There's that grass trainer at the end, but other than that, there's really no one that I'm like, oh, this is gonna be a tough fight. Turn this off. Oh, sorry, I still had the controller in my hand, so I was still playing, but the monitor up to my son's room was still on, so I apologize about that. That's another cool negative. Excellent. Just keep Zapdos up front.
don't think you ever use any of the X attack speeds and stuff. Well, you know, X accuracies are good if you want to hit with those uh, one hit KO moves. So if you can get, you know, that's what they do with speedrun strats. Um, if you can combine the X speed and the X accuracy and then just like fissure or horn drill through the entire team, that's how they beat the, uh, they make sure they beat the rival at the end of the game, the champion. Take him out, Zapdos. Oh, goodbye, Hypno. That's a free knockout later. Good level up, Zapdos. Alright, so if we can get Electrode up to level 54... We'll use our Rare Candies on the other two already. Oh, good critical hit, Electrode. Agility in place of Thundershock. Three. And four. Same thing with Magneton. Trying to learn Screech all the way up here at this level? No. All right, now if we can just level up Electrode a little bit, and then we'll use his rare candies, and then we won't be wasting any experience. And there are plenty of trainers for us to fight still to get Electrode up another two levels. One and a half, I really would think, with the experience he's gotten thus far. Wow, 
divide them do a whole lot. What? Poison that man. It was good we poisoned him before he made the substitute because he still took the damage from it. Alright, we're gonna switch Zapdos up just to start this next fight because the next trainer we fight starts with that Executor. And even though Electrode could take it on, it's just not a good matchup for him. That's -a me, a prodigy. Cloister. There's one level for Electro to do one more for him. Should get quite a bit from this Lapras here of experience. Good critical electrode. Got a Moltres here, which everybody will be able to completely destroy with electric attacks. I fire spun us. All right, well we'll just use a hyper potion here. That critical hit was a little unnecessary, but okay.
Those pushes are the longest. Get destroyed! Goodbye, Dugong. Good level up. I would actually let Electro fight it, but I don't want to waste the experience if we're just going to level him up again. So we'll let Zapdos fight it. Goodbye, Chansey. Alright, this is the one with the grass Pokemon. We're just gonna let Zapdos knock him out. Easy peasy. Only the chosen can pass over here. Well, I am the chosen one. Hello, Kingler. Goodbye, Kingler. All right, everybody. We made it. It is time.
a little bit of housekeeping right just before we go in, of course. Let's get Mew off the slot there because we're going to deposit him. Let's just sell the items we don't need. Looks good. Uh, how many did I have? Uh, we had seven, four, and two. So let's buy eight of these. Six of these, and not max potions, where are the, there they are, full restores. All right, everybody, it is time. Here we go. Let's take a look at the team before we go in. Magneton, level 57, 146 HP, 92 attack, 149 defense, 104 speed, 162 special, Thunder, Thunder Wave, rest and double edge. Electrode, 161 HP at level 57, 85 attack, 110 defense, 194 speed, 115 special, Thunderbolt, Thunder Wave, Toxic and Swift. And Zapdos, level 57, 207 HP, 145 attack, 137 defense, 142 speed, and 183 special. Thunder, Swift, Agility, and Drill Peck is what we're looking at for these movesets. Magneton is going to start off on the team as we go in to take on Lorelei. Yeah, pretty decent stats for all, you're right. Good hit right off the bat on this dugong. Get out of here. Cloista the Oyster coming out next. Missed it, of course we did. Ah, uh, you spike cannon, that's like the, one of the worst moves. Would have been a lot more scared of Clamp. Two Thunders missed. All right. And there's the Clamp. Magneton, you're already letting us down. Come on, buddy. Well, at least he hit the slow bro before it started popping some amnesias. Oh, it's fast with that lovely kiss. Alright, well I was not expecting that. I'm gonna take a couple. Jinx is pretty high special. Maybe we can do some decent damage to it with a swift. Yeah. Decent enough. Oh, well, that's a bad attack.
All right, we are going to Thunder Wave this Lapras just to be, you know, just in case <laughs> a Thunderbolt didn't take it out. I want to make sure that it's slow. Good job weathering that electrode. That shouldn't do near as much as even what the blizzard did. We should still be fine. He only did 80... Well, it didn't quite do that. Unless he, you know, unless he criticals us. Which he didn't, so the th second Thunderbolt will take it out. Alright, that's one down. Lorelei always proves a bigger challenge than I really expect her to be. Why are you not asleep? When I switched you out, you were asleep. All right, swap electrode up front. One of the only times, one of the only playthroughs that I'm worried about a lodestone. I don't think they know Earthquake. I could be wrong, though. Oh, they don't dig. Hey, but we have an answer for this. That's not going to do anything, you loser. And I can still hit you with Swift Underground. Oh, Lodestone. I just don't think I knew what to do after we switched to Zapdos. Okay, so this one knows Rock Slide, which is not super effective against Electro, but would be against Zapdos. Rock Slide and Slam. There's the Earthquake. So this Onyx is actually dangerous. But he's got such low attack. Look at that. Electro doesn't even care. X defend. Right as it's about to go down to a toxic? Man. 
what a, some Elite Four this is. And Onyx Dangerous, never thought you'd hear that. <laughs> Two Elite Four down. Two to go, and then the champion. Alright, we're gonna swap Zapdos up. You're just hot for Professor Oak. Fiddles with his Pokedex. They are bulky enough to survive a drill pack, but not too. Still like to level up Magna a ton to level 58 with everybody else. Man, Magna ton, come on! All you gotta do is hit a thunder. And now look, now you're toxic. Oh my goodness! Sometimes, Magneton. Sometimes. You are just... Really a pain in the butt. All right, where's my full restores? Yay! That's the level up I was looking for. Oh, that's annoying. Be better and get past it. Yeah, be better than Magneton. All right, time for Lance. Thank you. 
All right, here comes Gyarados. You said if we hit it, no problem. The two Dragonairs are going to face Zapdos. Nice try. Aerodactyl coming out. We'll swap back to Magneton. not resistant to uh, electric attacks because it's rock flying. Magneton's got that bulky defense. I was pretty sure he'd be able to do really well against a hyper beam from it. Get out of here, Aerodactyl. Alright, we're going to let Electro take the field against the Dragonite to start out. Interesting. Hey, you missed that one. Does normal amount of damage. Blizzard. Well, that's disconcerting for Zapdos coming out. Oh, but look, Electrode's fine. Oh, we're out of hypers. That's the attack I was really worried about, was the hyper beam. He didn't critical us. And since he's got a recharge a turn, we should be able to easily take him out before he can attack us again. All right, champion time. Tons of thunders. We're gonna use an either on Zapdos Drill Packs. And then we're going to use two full restores. Oh, three full restores. Look at everybody at full health. Yeah, nice fight so far, and you're right. I don't think the rivals our rivals would be difficult at all. We stopped them just before the Elite Four. We'll stop them again right here. He starts with his Sand Slash, so we're going to start with Zapdos. Good critical hit. We are still out racing you though, Sand Slash. K 
He sends out a fast Pokemon, we'll send out a faster Pokemon. <laughs> he hasn't dropped a reflect yet. Critical hit. Ah, oh, recover gross. Another good or critical hit and a good paralysis to follow. All right, we should have him now. I have you now. Oh no! Of course, we came confused. Ah, good full paralysis. Couldn't risk it though. Yeah, this is what I was going to have Zapdos take on next anyways. Uh, we'll just let you sleep for a little bit. I'm just going to take a turn to uh, heal up Electrode, because Electrode is going to fight Jolteon. Oh, okay, you full restore as well. Doodle dude on my flute. Ah, <laughs> barrage. You call yourself a champion? This poor executor. You're just wasting my time to hit me five times with that. Everybody's going to get on this fight against our rival. Quick attack. Oh my goodness, Magneton, you miss so many thunder attacks. Good critical hit, though. And here comes Jolteon. We'll just send out Electrode. Hey there, buddy. The timer is on. Seven damage. Yeah, he should have just stuck with a quick attack. That was better. Swift, swift. The most you're doing with that is 35 damage. Unless you critical me. So long, Jolteon. Yeah, but he didn't, Kren. <laughs> I'm 
GG. All right. That for the part everybody likes. <laughs> Let's see what our next team's gonna be. There's a couple things that we do know already. We already know that we're gonna be playing on Pokemon Red next. <laughs> nice, you did it. 29 playthroughs down. All with the big old V for victory. Ba -da -da -da. Ba -ba 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 -ba. So that's actually the last uh, legendary Pokemon we have to use. That's the last legendary one. Yeah, the hardest for this was definitely Giovanni's Rhydon. I was not expecting it to know Rock Slide and Earthquake. Holy moly. You know, Electro really wasn't that bad late game with his speed and toxic. Own seven Pokemon. You gotta go walk around that tall grass, man. All right. So let's get to our dice roller. Uh, so, we need to see what starter our um, rival is going to have. Uh, so, we'll choose for ourselves what we'll pick. 1 and 2 is Bulbasaur, 3 and 4 is Charmander, 5 and 6 is Squirtle. We are going to pick a Squirtle, which means our rival is going to have a Bulbasaur. So, the question is, what type are we going to have next? We have six types left. Uh, so, I'll just roll a d6. And we have uh, Fire. So, in this order, 1 is Fire. 2 is Water. Three will be normal, five will be ground, and six will be rock. And drum roll, boom, four. So that means we are going to have our... Oh, I forgot to say electric. So I apologize. One was fire, two was water, three was normal, five was... Or four was ground, five was electric, and six was rock. So four means we're going to have our very first ground-type playthrough. Which means we're going to have a team of four. And so there are eight ground type Pokemon. So we're just going to roll and see what we get here on this D8. So uh, we have Cubone, Diglett, Geodude, Male Nidoran, Female Nidoran, Onyx, Rhyhorn, and Sandshrew. And boom, five. One, two, three, four, five. We're going to have the female Nidoran. Boom, seven. Rhyhorn. Boom, three. Geodude. And boom, eight. Sandshrew. So our team for our first ground type playthrough is going to be uh, Geodude, female Nidoran, Rhyhorn, and Sandshrew. Sorry, no second lodestone. I do apologize. <laughs> 